Oh, what's going on, family? It's your man, DeAndre Saxon, back for another video coming to you from beautiful Dubai. It is currently 6.30. And you're going to see the sun coming down here on my right side. But without further ado, let's get into it. Big motion. You're on this video because you want to learn how to earn seven figures. We're not even thinking about six figures. If we're thinking about six figures, we're thinking about six figures a month. That's the kind of belief I want you to have if you're coming into this community. Guys, I went from zero to 100,000 a month in 45 days after being broke for five years. And it taught me many many, many things. So in this video, I'm going to be showing you the three steps that you can implement today to have big motion going into the future, talking about living the lifestyle that you want, traveling the world, building a six and seven figure business and living the life that you desire. These are the things that I've accumulated. It helped me earn seven figures by the time I was 25. And so without further ado, let's get locked in. So let's talk about step number one. And I was thinking about this video and I was, ah, man, I've, I've been loving you guys in the com community lately. Uh, just, I read all your guys' comments. It encourages me like I'm here on a Sunday night making this video for you guys so that you guys can grow and as I pour into you I feel a sense of uh, contribution and wholeness so I love it so I have to get you guys to understand this you want big motion right you're seeing everybody on Instagram earning six and seven figures you're trying to drive your Lamborghini you're trying to drive your dream car whatever you want man you you you, you have some vision of who you want to be but I have to get you to do this first because we have been conditioned our entire life to think that for us to have big motion, earn a lot of money, live our dream life, that it's gonna come from outside of us. Step number one, you have to understand that your consciousness, your thinking patterns have created your current lifestyle. I don't care if you're sleeping on a couch right now, I slept on a couch, I slept on air mattresses, I slept in my car for five months. It doesn't matter where you're coming from, brother. You have to understand this base because if I go into step number two, step number three, and tell you all these things by the end of this video, if you don't get this first base down, then and nothing else is going to work. You have to understand that everything that's in your life right now, you have created it. And you have created it right here with your thinking patterns. So step number one is you have to understand that your consciousness has created your reality, which is fine. If you're living in poverty, meaning you're not living the dream life that you want, poverty can even be 10,000 a month, 20,000 a month. Like guys, there's times I've spent $5,000 in a day for dinner. Like, cause it, there's levels to this stuff. I'm in Dubai where somebody spent $200,000 today. You know, like there's levels to this stuff. But one thing you have to understand is this, if you're gonna wanna start putting money into your life and attracting it, we have to switch your brain, more importantly, your consciousness from poverty to abundance. Brother, here's the honest truth, and, I, and this is why people like me, and I'm always gonna tell you the truth, there's no fluff, I'm gonna tell you directly. Your family has most likely set you up to be poor right now. Your environment, who you came from. Guys, I come from a family where I, my grandparents loved me, but guess what? They never made more than probably 15000 a month combined. Like, I was like middle class, but guess what? There's points I'd make 200000 a month, and I'm over here blowing bottles and living like a rock star, thinking like, oh my gosh, this is life. But I didn't have the right foundation. And that first thing is called a paradigm. So step number one is we have to switch your paradigm, which is your, your, your multitude of habits. It's the way in which you view the world. It's your habits. It's, it's like the lens in which you see the world. Like right now, um, I got this beautiful sun to the right. I got the pool here, beautiful Dubai sun's coming down. So you might see the lighting change here, but I'm looking at this clear lens right now, straight out. But what if I had a filter, let's just say a, a darker filter, no matter how clear it is outside, I would be viewing the world through a filter. The consciousness you have right now is the filter in which you see the world. So the first step I have to get you, if you want to start earning money, brother, I got to get you to change your filter. I got to get you to change how you see yourself. And most importantly, how you see the world and understand that your deep down consciousness and how you see yourself, this idea of self is the first step into changing. Okay. So, paradigm is a multitude of your habits. I want you to think about it, about it as like your mental conditioning or your mental programming. Like right now, let's, let's, for example, I got an iPhone right here. So this iPhone is run on iOS, right? Apple software. So it's software. No matter what, I can't run an Android program on this software because deep down this device, as much as it's physical, is running on a software program for Apple products. Very simple to understand, right? Inside of your subconscious mind right now is a deep, program and it controls what comes into your life and what comes out of your life and brother it's controlling how much money you earn you can be in like one of multiple categories here's where most people my clients will they'll be stuck at right and the first level is they're they're struggling to even get up by right they're there's they don't have I, I never had more than two thousand dollars in my bank account till I was 24 years old just think about that so these are the guys that are just trying to get off the ground they're, they have this image that they want to be successful they're reading the books they're going to seminars they're investing in themselves but it seems like they can't 
can't get off the ground, right? That's the first kind of paradigm we talk about. The second one is the guy who's stuck. He's inconsistent, right? One month he's making 10,000, the next one 20, then drops back down to seven, five, four, 10, 30, right? He's just up and down, up and down. And he can't, he can't seem to find consistency. The third type of paradigm is the guy who's stuck, right? Usually 30,000 a month, 100,000 a month. There's some kind of level where this guy gets stuck. I don't care where it's at. And he, and it's like, no matter how hard he works, he gets a little bit, but, and it drops back down and he can't seem to go to the next level, right? These are different areas and categories that you might fall under. Either one, either one, it doesn't matter because there's this firm foundation, which goes back to that paradigm is how you see yourself brother so in step number one what we're going to want to do is we're going to want to switch how we see ourselves we're going to want to switch our paradigm our multitude of habits the way in which we see ourselves so let's that's a perfect transition to go into step number two here so we can get some motion step number two is we're, we're going to want to set the right goal now i know this sounds kind of weird i remember when i hired my mentor bob proctor i was i was just struggling and i was trying to figure out how to get my business and my life together and he said, DeAndre, the first step to success is you have to set the right goal. Now, me having an ego at 24 years old being dead broke, I thought I knew how to set goals. All right? I didn't need a course or school or mentor to teach me how to set goals. But man, was I further from the truth? Because he taught me that, DeAndre, goals are not to get. Goals are not to, 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 to get certain things, hit income levels. A goal is to grow. And DeAndre, you have to set a goal so big that it causes you to shift your identity. It causes you to shift how you see yourself. And it causes you to do things that you never would have done before you know when my clients hire me one of the biggest problems that they have is that they are setting the wrong goals for example a client just hired me she's making 15,000 a month and she's like DeAndre I want to get to 20,000 a month and she's been stuck for the last six months and I said that's your first problem you're not setting the right goal because you're the same person to go from 15,000 a month to 20,000 a month it doesn't cause you to change your habits who you are your identity how you see yourself you basically just work a little bit harder and that's not working for you you've hit your character level which I've talked about multiple times it's like you're not gonna have to, you're not gonna shift you're not gonna change the first step that Bob said is you got to set a goal so big that it causes you to dream it's something that you really want it's something so big so grand it's a fantasy it's a complete imagination it's childlike and I said okay like let's set it and I was like you know what the most I'd ever earned at my at the period of my time when I met Bob in 2020 I earned like 6,000 one time. I said, Bob, I want to make 10,000. He's like, dream bigger. I said, 30,000. Think about this, guys. I don't know anybody in my family. Still to this day, there's nobody in my family has ever earned 30,000 in a month. So here I am thinking, okay, I'll set 30,000 a month just, just so this guy can like, you know, get off my back. And then he's like, you know, DeAndre, you got to dream so big that it, that's like, it's scary. It's like a fantasy that it's like, you have to like, let go and let God. And I said, you know what, Bob, let's do 100,000. I like that number. I don't, I don't know if I'm going to make that kind of money, but let's set it. Guys, 45 days later I hit it and I started to fully understand why so step number two when you set this goal brother I want you to dream so big that it causes you to have to do things that you've never done before because if you think big you act big if you act big you get big results and it's that shift in consciousness remember step number one it's this shift in consciousness of setting a big goal so big that's going to cause you to do different things that you've never would have done before so let's just say your goal is 10,000 a month 20,000 a month something like this and you're and you've been living at your mom's house or you're living in a regular apartment driving a regular car and the problem that you're having right now brother is that you're bouncing back and forth between what you think you can do and what you know you can do you're like man i can crush five thousand this month i can crush ten thousand twenty thousand the number is irrelevant right i can crush this number this month but really i want is this number and halfway through the month you're going for that goal it doesn't seem like it's materializing and you're like you know what i don't think i can hit this goal this month but I can crush this. So you're bouncing back and forth between what you think you can do and what you know you can do, what you think you can do and what you know you can do. And there's no growth there. That's why you've been stuck, brother. If we want to get you to the next level in your life, we're going to have to cause you to do things that you've never done before. You have to have, you have to be inspired. You have to be inspired by a fantasy. You have to get down and write down a piece of paper. What do you want with your life? very clearly so step number two an action step that we're going to have when we set this goal is we're going to set something called a c type goal make sure you subscribe to my channel because i'm going to have to break all of these downs in multiple different videos throughout the next coming months in in, in time here so make sure you subscribe below i'll make more videos on this so we're going to create something called a c type goal 
a C type goal is a fantasy. Brother, it's something that you really, really want. It's not something that your brother wants, that your girlfriend wants, that, that your mom wants. It's something that you want. And do not think about one second how you're gonna get it. Do not think about one second where the money's gonna come from, the resources, the, pay, the people, none of that. Brother, I want you to really get down to your core. What do you really want with your life? And that was a question that you probably never been asked before. But this, I'm causing you to think. Remember, step number one, consciousness. I'm causing you to think. Think differently about yourself. Think th differently about how you see the world. What do you really want? What kind of car do you want? Regardless of how much it costs or where the money's going to come from or if you have the business or not, the resources. And I well, here's what we're going to do. You're going to get out a piece of paper. You're going to write down exactly what you want, like a shopping list. Where do you want to live? How do you want to live? What kind of girlfriend do you want? What kind of car? What kind of body? How do you want to live, brother? Make it like a video game, like GTA. You have a cheat code and you can do anything you want in your life. That's how this world works. And that jumps off the basis of step number one, which is consciousness. You have the ability to create your life by just your thinking and your mental. You want big motion? You want seven figures? You want, you want jewelry? You want nice stuff? You want a, whatever you want in your life? Bro, it starts right here. When we shift how you see yourself, when we shift this, this world around you, the person that changes the most will see the most change in their life. That's why you're watching this video, brother. You're tired of being stuck. You want change. And by the end of this video, you will have that change. So don't get off. Don't get distracted. Get off that other tab. Stay right here. That Instagram post is not going to change your life. That girl calling you, that's not going to change your life. This video, I'm here for free trying to change your life without asking for a single dollar, brother, because I care about you going to the next level. And I know that one day if I change your life, you're going to come message me, DM me, come see, me, come visit me here in Dubai and say, DeAndre, look at what I've created because of you. And that's all I really want. Okay. So let's keep getting into it. So you're going to write down, brother, the shopping list. How do you want your life to be? What would it look like? Right. If you want a Lambo, for example, let's go, let's go around a route of cars. You want a Lambo. Is it, is it a Aventador? Is it an SV? Is it a Roadster? What color interior you got? You want a G-Wagon? Is it a regular G-Wagon or you got a Brabus? Man, I'm out here in Dubai. Everybody's got a Brabus, man. I got a Nardo gray Brabus with a baby blue interior just in my mind, just ready for me to cop it. The world will give you whatever you want. The world will bend to her knees and please you if you declare exactly what you want. So what we're going to do, we're going to take this shopping list now, okay? And we're going to find out out of this list what exactly is, needs to happen, right? Who do you need to become in order to attract that? Anything that's on the outside world is always a reflection of who you are, brother. Now, even though we have a list here, here's the most important question we have to ask. is not what we have to do to get this. What do we have to have to get this? Who do you need to become? This is a very, very important question. Who do you need to become? What level of a version of yourself do you have to become, brother, so that you can achieve that goal? Because remember, a goal is not to get something. We're not writing this shopping list just to gather things. We're writing this shopping list down so you can become a better version of yourself. Do you understand this? It's a different frequency. It's a different vibration. Where you're at right now is nothing compared to where you're going to be, who you need to become in order to achieve that goal. For example, let's stay on this uh, idea of this Brabus, right? So about half a million dollars. Shit, boy, driving a half million dollar car. Yeah. <laughs> I have to ask myself, well, who do I need to become in order to drive that car? I have to create content right here for you guys. I have to serve you at a higher level. Right now, this video is a little bit longer than usual, but I knew it was going to be because I knew how to serve you a lot more. I couldn't just cover the surface. And each video is going to get better and better and better. So by me serving you at a higher level, giving you value, getting, getting you out there to make more money and change your life, eventually at some point, you're going to want to hire me as a coach. And the more people I service, the more content I can help people for free, the more that money just flows to me because I become more valuable. So now I have to serve X amount of clients in order to make my half million dollars and now the brabus keys are sitting here right here in my hand so that's an ex that's an example of who you need to become right so now let's start to move into th number three so number one was consciousness this understanding that brother if you want big motion we have to take your mind out of poverty thinking the one that was created by your family your environment where you came from we got to take out that poverty thinking and we're going to flip it and we got to put abundance thinking thinking bigger dreaming bigger doing more being more having more right so that's the first foundation now second foundation is we got to set a goal so big that it causes you to grow it's a fantasy something that you want it's something that gets you out of bed and you're 
excited about, something that's going to scare you and it's going to cause you to do things you've never done before because that's where the growth is because now you're shifting your identity. You're becoming a different version of yourself and that's where the change is and you'll start to attract new things on your frequency. So let's go into step number three now, how to big, have big motion going out there and building your first six and seven figure business, living your dream life. Daily disciplines, locking in, brother. I, um, you know, if, you follow, if you're not following me on Instagram, make sure you follow me on Instagram. That's where I put a lot of more, my more easier content, especially like B-roll life. Like, honestly, I don't have a video editor right now, so I don't sit here and add a bunch of photos and videos on this YouTube videos, but on Instagram, I do. So here, my old life was degeneracy, bro. Think about this. You're 25 years old. You're earning six figures a month, which is about like three to $5,000 a day, right? Uh, on, and sometimes I make 10 grand in a day, 20 grand in a day, right? What would you do if you're 25? Living in Miami, you never come for money. What would you do? Splurge, come on, jewelry, girls, partying, alcohol, travel. I did all of that, brother. And let me tell you this. As much as I'm, I had fun, I don't regret it. I got distracted and I lost my first seven-figure business because I was distracted. Brother, for us to go into step number three, you're going to have to lock in. This is so important. This is coming from a guy who's been having motion, a guy who's good with girls. Man, I, I ain't got to, man, you just look at me, boy. Come on now. You think I have a problem with girls? I, but I, I'm putting them on the side. They, that doesn't do nothing for me. If anything, that takes away from my energy. When was the last time you met up with Shorty and afterwards you're like ready to conquer the world, brother? Like it just doesn't happen. You want to just nap and sleep. Nah, bro, like keep that shorty. Like I'm going to keep my energy right here. I'm going to stay mentally locked in, spiritually locked in, physically locked in because I am becoming a better version of myself so I can achieve my goal. That's the mentality you want to have. These mentors, these people used to say these things, but I was so distracted. I was in the field. I was cloudy. We talked about this in the video, Stop Chasing Bitches. But guys, when you start, when you're chasing women, which is, I think, I mean, I drank a little bit, never, I mean, drugs, never really a big problem for me. It was the shorties, bro. And let me tell you this, there was periods, man, I would have two shorties a day, three shorties a day. Like I was running game, man. Rotation was crazy. But you know what I lost in the process of that? Mental clarity. And brother, that's something that we learned in step number one, that your consciousness, your clarity, your lens in which you see the world controls everything that comes in and out of your life. So you think that after me running game, being distracted, cloudy, drinking, just being a degenerate for weeks on weeks on end, you think I have the self image at this point? You think I had the self image to become my my goal to be a better version of myself no i wasn't locked in because of that i was distracted and i started attracting more negativity into my life not only that the shorties that we're messing with man come on now like we all we all like bad shorties like we got we got the nice girls but man ain't, there's something about a bad shorty with tattoos that you know what i'm saying man i like that shit man but that, that's not good for my energy like shorty's energy is tainted and that i don't know what's that's some other surprise some trauma i need to take care of but i like those shorties man that's all tatted all up in the back and all that stuff that's crazy though but that energy would mix with mine and then i'm over here trying to create content, build a YouTube channel, build a seven figure business. And I'm not focused. I'm lacking clarity, brother. You're going to have to lock in, drop the shorty just for six months. It'll be worth it. I'm in the game now, right now. And I'm doing that. I'm in Dubai. You think I, I wouldn't want to go out there and just be out with shorties. That, like even here, right here at the pool. I can, but I choose not to because we're in number three. We're locking in. We're getting our daily discipline so that we can keep mentally clear so that we can become the better version of ourselves. So what are some of those daily disciplines that uh, we're going we're gonna to implement? By the way, go ahead and drop a like on this video. Subscribe below. If you're watching to this point, you are locked in, brother. You have what it takes. Everybody else has clicked off this video. They're distracted. They went on TikTok. They can't even hold their attention for five freaking minutes to become a better version of themselves. And I'm giving this to you guys for free. And you're locked in, brother, because you're the chosen one. I'm on, we're on the same frequency. Do you feel this right now? You and I are on the same frequency. That's why you're still here, because what I'm saying is penetrating your mind and you know deep down inside this is your time to level up. It's your time to stop what you said, like you would say things and then you would quit, right? You never kept your word to yourself, but now you've made a decision. That's why you're still here in this video. And now I'm here to encourage you every single day, Mike, making these YouTube videos, because not only does it like, do you get encouraged? I encourage watching your comments, you being locked in on the community. So we're going to have to implement some daily act, uh, daily actions and daily activities. First, number one is, I know it's a lot, bro, but trust me, I'm going to be making more and more content. Sometimes you just need to hear this over and over again. Step number one, we're going to have to get up early, okay? We have to lock in a true wake up time every single time. Now, I used to hear mentors say this all the time and I never did it, but it wasn't until I hired Wes Watson and I actually started implementing it that I actually see changes in my life. So what we're going to want to do is 4 a.m. to 6 a.m. 
okay? If you're just, like, I used to wake up at 9 a.m., 6 a.m., or sorry, it's 9 a.m., 10 o'clock, but for me, the best transition was 6 a.m., right? I didn't have to go to bed till about 11 o'clock, so for my night hours that you can stay up to 11, if you really can sleep on less hours, you can push it to 12, but a good transition for me was 6 a.m. I just bumped it up to 5 a.m. I'm not in the 4 a.m. club yet, or 2.45 like Wes Watson, but right now, guys, there's something that happens when you wake up early. Most importantly, you might be thinking, well, man, this is I, this is exactly what you might be thinking, because this is how I used to think. I'd be like, well, you know, why do I have to wake up early, late? Because I have all day to think, go to the gym, I have all day to read, or or maybe I don't have that much motion right now, so I have a lot of free time. Brother, this is why you need to lock in. If you got no motion right now, if you have more time on your hand, this is exactly why you need to get up early so you can put motion in you. Because remember, it goes back to step number one, your consciousness. As you start to keep your word to yourself, as you start to level up yourself, you start to get the sense of pride. And that sense of pride raises how you see yourself, raises your consciousness, and you start to attract new things into your life. Guys, this is the secret. The secret is not going out there and looking for some random business model. By the way, as you notice, I'm not talking about a specific business model. I don't care if you're doing Amazon, YouTube automation, network marketing, or coaching, whatever business, it doesn't matter because what we're talking about is this. The motion is here because if you have motion in your mind, you're going to have motion in the physical world. So attach what I'm saying to whatever you're doing outside. No business is going to come save you, brother. Coming from somebody who's failed, I failed at 20 businesses 20 businesses I failed at and it wasn't until I met Bob Proctor and I got my subconscious mind right all these different steps that actually went zero to 100 grand a month in 45 days it was never the business model it was these steps I'm talking about right now that changed my life you want big motion you got to change this so step number one is we're going to start waking up early anywhere from 4 a.m to 6 a.m. Start at 6 a.m. if you're uh, just getting started or you can go straight forward depending on what you want. Second thing, we gotta drop your vices. This is all part of locking in, right? Step number three, you gotta drop the vices. Remember, in this period of time, guys, we're going for that seven-figure run. You need every ounce of attention on yourself and on your business. We need every ounce of attention on the, the, your thinking patterns. We need to be mentally clear. Bro, how can you come out here? I'm getting the chills thinking about this. How can we come out here and say, oh man, we're gonna, we're, we got big motion, we're creating motion, we're on our seven figure run, and you're out here chasing Shorty up till four in the morning, doing God knows what, you, you're on drugs, you're drinking alcohol, and the next day you're cloudy, you don't even have the mental clarity to, to be in motion. You're out of motion. You're in the sideline, bro. You're going to have to lock in just for six months. And this is coming from a guy who's been in the game. Like people used to say, oh, lock in or don't talk to girls. I'm like, dude, you don't even look like you can get girls. Like, let's just let's just keep it 100. Like, no cap. But guys, I'm com coming from a guy who's been in the game. I'm telling you as your big brother, guy a couple steps ahead of you, it's worth it. Just drop the shorties for a little bit. Get off the hub. Stop the alcohol. Stop the drugs. Just so you can get your mind right. Just so you can have clarity. Because you need that clarity so that you can put that attention on what you want. Because remember, your consciousness, your attention is dictating what's coming in and out of your life. And so if you're distracted and foggy because of this situation and this shorty and this girl and this... Then, of course, you're not got no motion, boy. Even if you did get motion, you're extending it out. If you're like me, I want my shit fast. I'm, I'm, I get a little impatient. So if you want to have motion faster, you need to just lock in and keep as much attention every single day on what you want, on that goal that we wrote in step number two. So we've got to get up early. Number two, we've got to drop the vices, the alcohol, the drugs, the girls, the shorties, the hub, all this kind of stuff. Next one is you're gonna, you need a personal development plan. You need to be leveling up. It's not good enough to just think about and meditate and all this kind of stuff, which is great. I teach these to all my clients, but you need a personal development plan. Brother, everybody wants to manifest a life and create a vision of themselves without leveling themselves up, but actually structured plan. Like, that's literally how I started. Everybody, like, I can't even lie to you guys. Like, I hired this guy, Bob Proctor. I had $100 in my bank account. He said, yo, DeAndre, give me $30,000. You can work with me. I'm like, bro, I'm sleeping in my car at this event. I, I don't got $30,000. But I was like, man, how can I get some money? Do you got a payment plan? He's like, yeah, you could drop five grand. And I'm like, how can I get five grand? I put it on my grandpa's credit card. Like, that's how hungry I was. You're hungry because you're still watching it right now, this video. I was hungry and I just needed a plan and he gave me the step-by-step -step plan, seven, or sorry, 12 steps week by week and I just studied it. By lesson four of the program, two months in, I'm making 100 grand a month. Brother, you need a personal development plan. It's not good enough to just read books. You need a, you need a plan, a structured plan on how you can level up yourself, a structured plan on how you can upgrade your consciousness, upgrade your mental, 
understanding your conscious mind, your subconscious mind, your habits, leveling yourself up. Now, this is actually a perfect segue for my school community. Join the community below. I have that program I used to sell for $10,000. I have over 300 clients that paid me for that, the same program that made me seven figures from Bob Proctor. I give it to you guys for free, all inside the school community, inside the classroom section, right? So if you wanna have an actual personal development plan, you need it. Um, this is me being transparent. Whether you buy from me or not, brother, it's not, that's not the point of this video. You need some kind of step-by-step -step plan to elevate your consciousness, to elevate your character, to level yourself up. Whether you hire Tony Robbins, Bob Proctor, or anybody, or, or join my school community because you like this, all of that, since in, it is a paid group, but you can find all this stuff in there. Whatever you want, you need that plan. Okay, the next one is you're gonna wanna start posting content. And for some of you, you're like, some, oh, bro, I don't wanna post content, I'm not good on camera. Brother, it's something that happens when you take this information and you share it with others. You don't have to share it like you're an expert. I remember when I started with Bob Proctor and I was trying to get my mind right, I, I wasn't an expert in mindset. Shit, I just bought this thing a week ago. You think I was an expert? No, what I did was I just documented the process. What do you think I'm doing here? Like, I'm just documenting the process. I'm documenting the mistakes that I made, the progress that I made so that you can do it, right? Start making some content, sharing it with the world. And as you share with other people, what will happen is you'll find this deeper sense of purpose, but then you'll learn the material better. Share, some, share your wake up time, post it on Instagram, show your gym routine, show the things that you're doing, show your personal development plan, show the book that you're reading, show these things to the world and show people that you are actually leveling up. And then the fourth one that we're gonna do as far as locking in, there's a couple other things, I'm just giving you guys this quick little um, thing, is you gotta hit this gym, brother. Look at this, we busting out the shirt, look at this, ah! Getting in the gym, bro. How can you be a man and have tits? Like, let's keep it 100. You have to wanna be able to take your shirt off at, at the pool right now, and shorties just look at you. You're tan, you're tatted, you look like a freaking beast, right? Shoulders popping out, look at this. Oh, you want this for yourself, brother? I, I, don't, I didn't hit the gym to be a personal trainer. I hit the gym not only for my mental clarity, but because a man is supposed to be a guy that has a body of a god, right? Just building it. Am I perfect yet? No, absolutely not. But guess what? I'm a, you, you're going to see me in the gym tomorrow every single day in the gym growing, growing my mind, growing my body, becoming a better, better version of myself. Remember, we talk about it. For us to elevate and attract new things, we have to raise our frequency. That goal that we wrote down, that C-type goal, that desire, it's on a different level. It's on a different frequency. So we have to raise our frequency. We have to raise the version of ourselves. And as we raise the version of ourselves, we effortlessly attract the things into our life. That's the law of attraction. So by getting in the gym and, and working out and being a better version of yourself mentally, spiritually, and leveling up, you'll see whole new things in your life. Guys, there's so much, so much to drop on you guys. And this is why I'm gonna be creating content every single day because I have a, a need to pour into you guys. I watch you guys in the comment section that these young men, they need to become better versions of themselves because everybody in TikTok and Instagram, they want you to be a degenerate. The universe, they want you, not the universe, sorry. The, the, the world, they want you to be a degenerate. They want you to be scrolling on TikTok mindlessly. They want you to go and look at all the shorties thirst trapping so you can get on the hub because it keeps you weak. And weak men, what does that do for you? When's the last time you did this shit and then you were ready to conquer the world? They want you dumb, brother. They want you to stay low. But guess what? You're not. You're waking up. You're starting to realize that you can raise your frequency, that you can become a better version of yourself, that you can live life that Grand Theft Auto, that gate in the life is like a video game when you start to treat it like a video game. But first, you have to understand the steps. And that's what this is all about. That's what my channel is about. Giving you guys the cheat code so that you can level yourself up, attract the things you want in your life, and be him. And have big motion every single day of your life. So guys, make sure you subscribe below. Follow me on Instagram. That's where I do a lot of the content. And if you want to be in a community of other men that are basically doing the same thing as me, locking in, getting to the next level, hitting seven figures. By the, by the way, we don't talk about six figures here. Seven figures is the base minimum. If we talk about six figures, it's six figures a month. Let's keep that. Even if you have $5 in your bank account, I don't care. I need you in this circle. I need you in this belief level. You know that you are who you hang around with. So if we're talking about six figures a month, what are you going to think about? Are you okay with 10 grand? a month like your mom said or you're going to start thinking about six figures a month because that's community here that's what we talk about so make sure you can and by the way that personal development plan all that kind of stuff it's in the school group it is a paid group but guys you get so much access you get so much resources like it's so much i put in there just so you can level up and as you see here on this youtube video i don't hold anything back i want you to get to the next level so guys we have so much more subscribe below we got more content coming out tomorrow and i'll see you in the next video stay locked in